to my channel. I'm so happy that you're here with us today. I've got a great video lined up for you guys, but if you're new, I just wanted to say, hey, my name is Sky. I am the owner of our online home decor shop called House and Home, and I also run this YouTube account where we share all things home from our favorite recipes to DIYs, projects around the home, decorating and style with me videos, day in the lives, all the things. So I am just so glad you're here. I hope you'll hit that subscribe button and um, just be along for the ride. So today's video is my Amazon favorite video home edition. So it's not gonna be like all of the other Amazon favorite videos that you are seeing out there right now. Um, now is the perfect time to do some online shopping, but it's also the perfect time to do those updates on your home that you have just been dying to get done and couldn't find the time. So I thought I would blend those two themes together and give you guys my Amazon favorite home products. So let's get started. I'm not sure about you guys, but I love a good book. I am a mama to three littles ages five, three, and one, and my time for reading is pretty limited. So I actually like to listen to audiobooks and I like to listen to podcasts as I'm getting things done around the house or taking a drive. But I love to have beautiful books on our coffee table or around our house that I can just flip open for a little bit of inspiration and it's not something that I feel like I have to sit down and read a bunch of chapters all at once. So I'm sharing a few of my favorite books that also double as beautiful pieces on bookshelves or on your coffee table. So the first book is The Cozy White Cottage Book by Liz Marie Galvin. If you have been here for a while, you know that I love this book so much. It is chock full of so much home inspiration. She's got so many different styling tips. In fact, I think there's almost a hundred in here. There's a hundred styling tips in this book. Uh, decorating with candles and tea towels and how to do table settings. I mean, the list goes on and on. Not only is there so much great information in this book, but it is also just so beautiful and it has been a constant source of inspiration for me. So I always have this book sitting out on a table. Another book that I am loving and I'm sure that you have probably heard of is Homebody by Joanna Gaines. This book is also like the Cozy Cottage book in the sense that it is chock full of so much home inspiration, um, design and styling tips. It is truly just a gorgeous book to um, flip around with. I actually just got some inspiration for a project that we're doing in our laundry room right now um, from this book so definitely check these out if you are looking for something that um, is going to help give you guys some ideas for maybe projects in your own home or just a really cute um, book to put out on your coffee table and even a great gift uh, another great gift is this book called Get Out of Your Head by Jenny Allen. It is incredible. If you have not heard of it, make sure you hop over to Amazon right now. I have everything linked below um, so you can just hit the direct link and not have to worry about searching to find something. Um, but these are in the description below. This book is amazing. It's about our thoughts holding us captive and how to break free go ahead and read the back for you guys really quick because it is truly inspiring and this is what sucked me in. I read this and I was like, and I need this book right now. <laughs> it is so good. Okay, so it says, it's all in your head. Are your thoughts holding you captive? I'll never be good enough. Other people have better lives than I do. God couldn't really love me. Jenny Allen knows what it's like to swirl in a spiral of destructive thoughts, but she also knows that we don't have to stay stuck in toxic thinking patterns. As she discovered in her own life, God built a way for us to escape that downward spiral. 
Freedom comes when we refuse to be victims to our own thoughts and realize we have already been equipped with the power from God to fight and win the war for our minds. In Get Out of Your Head, Jenny inspires and equips us to transform our emotions, our outlook, and even our circumstances by taking control of our thoughts. Our enemy is determined to get in our heads to make us feel helpless, overwhelmed, and incapable of making a difference for the kingdom of God. But when we submit our minds to Christ, the promises and goodness of God flood our lives in remarkable ways. It starts in your head. And from there, the possibilities are endless. And I can tell you right now that this book does just that. It is so incredibly eye-opening and just, it's amazing. So if you need a good book, these three are so great. I also have the Magnolia Table Cookbook Volume 2 on my birthday list. My birthday is coming up, so I am trying to be patient and waiting um, to hopefully receive that, but that would also be another good one too. Okay, moving on from the books. These next couple of items are part of my coffee bar. You may have seen these if you saw my coffee bar decorate with me video. Um, so I'm gonna share them again because you may not have seen that and also I just love them that much and they are worth sharing. So this one is the electric tea kettle. Um, it is amazing. I've had it for a year and it has worked perfectly. Uh, you just fill it up to either the minimum or the maximum line and turn the switch on and it brews water so fast. We use it for making oatmeal, hot chocolate. We use it for the water um, to make tea or linen fogs. It really is just so great. And I mean, how cute is that little design? I love that it's white and neutral and just keeps my countertops looking clean and fresh. The next piece that I'm loving that's part of our coffee bar is our milk frother. This thing is amazing. You guys have seen me use it in a couple of videos. Um, you literally just put some milk in, press the button, and within like 30 seconds to a minute, you have warmed frothed milk for your coffee or tea. We have also um, done like family movie nights where we've done hot chocolate with the oatly chocolate milk so it's like oat milk but it's chocolate flavored and it's like no additional sweeteners or anything if that matters to you i prefer not to load the kids up on sugar because they already have so much energy um so when we do special nights like that i actually just pour that milk but you could totally use like regular chocolate milk i just pour that in here hit the froth button and it makes a cup of hot chocolate and it's amazing and delicious so you should totally check this one out it is such a good one and of course I have to share our coffee maker. It's a Cuisinart, it works perfectly, we love it so much, and it also just looks so fresh and sleek on the countertops. Next up is our kitchen cabinet hardware. Chad and I just love these poles that we picked out from Amazon. They just give off such a clean, sleek farmhouse feel. I added a tension rod to our kitchen windowsill and these little clips and put up some cloth napkins and I think that it is just the perfect way to fill that space while still allowing light to show in. It is still just beautiful, bright, and airy, but yet still offers just a little bit of coverage. This light fixture in our kitchen is one of my favorites. I just love the milk glass detail. And of course, the pharmacy mirror in our bathroom. You all loved this when we shared our shiplap bathroom tutorial video. It is such a great mirror and I love the little shelf. We also get a lot of compliments on our um, faucet for our vanity. It is so cute and farmhousey. I love the little hot and cool details on the little knobs. We also swapped out the hardware on all of the doors in our home, and I feel like it made such a difference. We got rid of the old brassy ones, and now we've got this crisp, clean black. 
You guys know that I am a huge fan of all things cozy and I love a good place to put my throws. I love this blanket ladder. It is so chic and simple and crisp and I just love throwing a blanket over there. Next are these farmhouse hooks that we got on Amazon. They give just a cute little rustic feel to any space. We've got them here on our entryway. It's a great way just to add some decor to your walls. We also put them on some old um, vintage windows that we had. I think they're just the perfect little touch. Next up is in our laundry room. We have these super cute peg rails perfect for styling your wall decor. We get so many compliments on our fan and light fixture in our living room so I thought that I would just put that in here as well. It is so cute and rustic looking and we love it. My absolute favorite is one that I saved for last. It is our Roomba vacuum. I have been using this for about five years and I turn it on every single day. It is a lifesaver. I am convinced that every single mom needs one of these. Okay friends, that is all for today's video. I'm so thankful that you watched. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite piece was and what you are rushing to Amazon to go get. If there is something in here that I left out that you are loving, please let me know that as well because I am always looking for new home products that I can just order with the click of a button, especially during, during this quarantine where we cannot leave the house and go browse the aisles of Target. Um, so yeah, keep me in the loop. Let me know what you're loving and I hope you'll hit that subscribe button if you haven't already just to join our community on here. I just love you guys and I'm so thankful for each one of you and all of the sweet comments that you leave me. It truly brings such a smile to my face and really brightens my day. So I hope you guys are doing well. I can't wait to see you in the next video. We are going to be sharing a little project we're doing in our laundry room and I think that you're going to love it. Thank you.